Uh, this is a quick follow up video to my uh, Cubo bike cam review video. People were asking me how exactly I mounted the camera to the handlebar. So this is the mount that that comes, this part that comes along with the camera. What I did is I simply put a ram ball to the stem of, of the rear mirror, use a short ram arm and then I printed this. I basically designed and I printed this part, this flat base, stem and the ball so using my uh, son's 3D printer at home and I stuck it to the curved uh, helmet mount which they gave, which comes along with the camera and this is the mechanism used to slot the camera in and start recording. So if you go to see, I secure this, Okay, I can orient it however I want and then I take the camera and I slide it in. As soon as I slide it, it starts working and starts recording. Now uh, this can uh, record for about 4 hours, so what I have done for continuous recording is I have taken a cable from my x -grip, which is uh, which is already connected to the battery of the bike, and I rolled it across the crossbar and put it here. So this way uh, the dash cam can work. Uh, all day long and that's about it so I disconnect press this slide it out it stops working it stops recording and this stays on the bike itself I don't think there's anything electronic on this just a, it's just a mechanism to slide in and then connect these two and so that's what I've done. So it, it would be nice if Hero Electronics uh, actually gave a mount, a handlebar mount, but uh, but when I called the helpline, they they said that it's not it's not yet available. So that's about it. Nothing more to add. It's a it's a it's a pretty simple thing. So slide it in, and it starts recording. It will turn on, see the red light and then after it turns on, it will initializing and the blue light, it will stay for about 5 seconds it, it should come there that's the blue light that started on and it will go off in a while but that means that it's recording the, it, it's gone now to turn it off you just press this down and slide it out you, you get beeps and the blue light beeps for a while and it stops that's it. It's off now. Okay. It's not recording. So a few people have asked about vibrations. Well, if if uh, the company has mentioned that you can mount it on a handlebar, I hope I hope they have designed for this uh, you know device to handle the vibrations because when you put it on a helmet, the vibrations are not that much because because your body acts like a you know shock absorber. But uh, let's see, I'm going to use this now for all my rides and uh, go through potholes and bad roads and then see exactly how this works. I'll give an update later, maybe in a few weeks or months, if this thing still works.